We are raring to go today. The ladies are awake. Okay, let's go, guys. We got our gliders. You got your gliders? Yeah. Woo! We're getting warm already. 
Looking good. Eight more. Make sure the back of your neck is in line with the rest of your spine. Four, three, two, other side. Now pause here. Set it up. Round chest. Long, tall spine. Knee over ankle. Down. Up. In. Exhale. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. I'm stay up. Pulse for 16. Make sure the core is engaged. All movement. Seven. Six. Keep pulsing those arms straight out in front of you. Chest tight. Get ready to down. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Hands on the floor. Angles cross. Cross. Bring it out. Boom. Again, do one more support for your spine. Hands to that side. Five. Six. Seven. Give me eight more, please. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Here's four. I feel that quad working. Woo! Take it back. Lift those arms up. Open it up. And pulse here. Oh, those thighs are saying good morning. They most certainly are. Keep it moving. Four, three, bring those arms chest tight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hold it here and open up that chest. Two, three. So feel the back muscles squeezing. Feel the front of the body stretching. Feels good. Now make sure these arms are noodle arms, right? There's muscles in them. Make them nice and strong. Four more, please. Four. Love it. Three. Two. One. Hands to the hips. And just tap. And tap. Small bend, knife come up. You got it. Eight. Seven. So don't think of leaning. It just stands upright. Now, instead of taking out wider, I'm going to go straight up and just tap where it was. See the difference? One hand to the side. And I'm still bending my knees and tapping that toe. Four, three, two. Take it back out wide. Two, three, four, four, three, two. Now, stay closer. You just tap wherever that foot was. Press those toes to the floor. Take it wider. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Smaller. Now I want you to bend more and stay here. So give me more of a squat. Yes. Eight, seven, six, five. Give me four more. Here's four. Three. I love it. Two and one. Just tap those toes forward. Okay, so when we transition to our gliders, we're going to take our mats and fold them in half and slide them off to the side. But not too far away because when we do our planks, I want our hands on the mats. Got it? Okay. Push it through. Smaller move in the legs. I'm in place to tapping. Again, opening my chest, squeezing the back muscles. Eight, seven, six, five, there's four, there's three, there's two, and one. Okay, take those mats in half, slide them away from the center. Let's grab those gliders. I want you to also grab your waist. Remember, if you don't have gliders, you can use towels, paper plates. Furniture movers. Okay, so if you're new to the gliders, make sure you have the soft side because we're on a hardwood floor. Soft side down. Okay. Half my foot is on, half my foot is off. When I'm moving, my heel has to be lifted, otherwise it's the foot. Okay. So I'm gonna hold these weights right here to my waistline. Elbows are pulled back. I'm gonna start with my right leg. I'm gonna get out for two. And in for two. Now, I want you to notice something. This is important. I want that knee to stay still. 
to track straight ahead with those toes. Out to two. Now, knee issues, you don't go out as far. <laughs> so you're choosing how far you go. Let's try tempo. Out, in. So there are three muscle groups working to bring that leg back in. The inner thighs, the glutes, and the core. Okay, I'm gonna add a punch out. Punch out, pull it back. Two, three, four. You got it. Proud chest. Go straight ahead. Woo! Give me eight more. Eight. Seven. I love it. Feels good. Five. Here's four. Three. Two. Let's take it to squat. Punch it down. Press it up. Easy part here. Woo! Press through those heels. Proud chest. Bring it up. Remember, when you're moving that 
heel has to be lifted. Inner thighs, glutes, core. Bigger now. Thighs and traps. Thighs, bring it back. Thighs. You got it. Now chest, I keep reminding you that it's so easy to get caught going like this, right? Why is that so important to have our chest proud and protect the lower back? Come on. Eight. And eight. Seven. Yeah. Seven. Six. Five. Three, four more. Look at that. She smiles on your faces today. I think it's amazing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Two more. One more. <laughs> so we're squat hammer curl. Hammers. Hammer. Hammer. Looking good, kid. Looking good. Bam. Now we're gonna pulse it. One, two, three. Yeah. Woo! My upper arm is glued to that mid page. Give me some control here. Bam, bam, bam. Let's Come on. Now keep pulsing. Okay. With my right toes. We're going to get a glider. That right heel. You know, lift off that glider. I'm still pulsing. Four, three, two. Here we go. Right back. Four, three, two. Switch the heel. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, switch the heel. Give me four. Switch, give me four. Can you feel your biceps too? Switch, give me twos. Now singles. Bam. Bam. Eight. Seven. Come on. Six. Four. Three. Two and one. Five. Five. Push. So now instead of me like doing a step out squat, I feel more like I'm ice skating. Woo. So I push off and glide. I'm pushing here. And I push from here. Four. Three. Good. Two and one. Take one disc away. Okay. Palms up. The move here is going to be take it out, pull it in. So I bend my standing leg. I pull it in. It's more like single leg work, right? Okay, head go. Now I'm going to do a set with this leg bending and straightening. My next set, I'm gonna keep it bent. <laughs> Three, two, same thing, but keep it bent now. Keep it bent. Out, in, out, in, bend. You got it. Out, in, eight, seven. Nice and controlled. Sit. Feel the back of that leg pull that glider as well. Yeah. Four, I probably lost count. Three, two, one, bring it up. Okay, other foot. Palms up. Four, three, two, now slow and practice. Out, in. Got it? Out. You gotta make sure the knee is facing straight ahead, just like the other knee. All right, so tempo, that leg is going to do bend and extend. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now, same thing with that standing leg stays bent. Yeah. We those back muscles. And pull it. Yes. Eight. Seven. Six. There's more of that coming up. Five. Four. Three. 
three, two, and one. Okay, take the weights down. We're gonna need both sliders. Okay? Now bring it close to where your mat is. Our hands are gonna come onto our mat. My knees are bent. I'm going to press one leg out at a time. Now, this is too hard for you. I want you to move your hands further up, have your knees on the mat, and just hold a modified flex. Okay? All right, so shoulders over wrist, tail is tucked, squeeze those arms in. My right leg is going to bend and then glide. Do it again. Bend, glide. Whoop. Bend, glide, bend, glide, bend, glide, one more, bend, glide, bring a knee in, other knee in, and relax toes, and make cup with those hands, and stretch back. Okay. Other side, you can modify, or you can do full plank. Are you ready? Press those legs out. Make sure you got your form. Left side, knee in, leg out. Knee in, leg out. Good. Crown the head is long, kids. Four more. Woo! Three. Good. Two more. Two. One more. And then drag that knee to your mat. Other knee, stretch back, and come with those hands. Nice and done. Now next, then you have options. I'm going to take it to my forearms. If that's not a full position for you, stay in a full plank, okay? All right, so here I am, shoulders over elbows. I got my toes ready on my sliders. I'm going to make sure my tail is slightly tucked. Arm coming off to the front and push those legs out. Hold here. Tuck that tail, push off that mat with those arms. Now I'm going to get to a jumping jack, out, in. So I'm only going as wide as my mat. And I'm squeezing those three muscle groups again. Inner thighs, glutes, core. Don't forget those squeezing those arm hips. Three, two, one, and then bring those knees to your mat and stretch back. We're going to do one more set of those. And you can choose forearms or full plank. Here we go. Press back those gliders. Here we go. Boom. Out. In. That's already two. We're already three. Here we are halfway through. Four. Three. Two. One, then draw those knees in, flatten those feet, and stretch back. Nicely done. Okay, grab onto those weights again. Now I'm going to flip around because I want to have more space for my feet and my shins. Okay? So knee issues, we're not going to possibly be able to sit back like this, right? If your knee is saying, uh-uh, no way. You're going to stay in the upright position, okay? There's always a choice, modification. I'm going to bring it down. I'm going to hold my elbows to my pace to start. Take your tail, slightly tuck it so I can feel the engage, and this is nice and flat, okay? I'm going to come up, hips push forward, and I'm going to lower it down. I want you to balance the dinner plate on top of your head. Up, and I'm going to come down. That's the waters. I'm also going to stretch to the top of my foot and the front of my ankles. Uh huh. Up. And down. Okay, now I'm going to take it to a two cow up. I'm going to punch one arm across the other side. So I'm going to go up, two, down, two. Up, punch the diagonal, come back down. I'm keeping that tail tucked in my core engaged. Glutes are firing. Hamstrings are firing, quads are working, and down. Up, up, down, down. Up, press, down, down. Up, press. How are we doing? 
I'm going to add on before I do a full roar. When I come up, I want you to lift your knee. Lunge back. The free knee. <laughs> Now, when I add on to this, the timing can be a little bit different. Okay? I'm going to add a plank to this. Watch. Knee down. Lunge back. Other foot taps. Bring it in. Pull it in. Knee up. Bring it down. Reach. Tap. Tap. In. Lift. Down. Hand down. Tap back. Step in, slide in, lift, slide, tap, in, push up, lift, down, down, in, in, up, one more, down, down, in, in, hold it here. Take those hands up. Pulse that knee, balance. So this standing leg, it's got to be straight, the beam is steel, lift the ribs away from the hips. Woo! Four more, four, two, one, and release. Grab back on your weight. Other leg. It's a challenge today. You mean pass it easy? Okay, you with me. <laughs> okay, ready? Let's go slow. Row it, glide it. Out for two. Pull it back for two. Out. Pull. Yeah. How's it feel? Knees okay? You're tracking straight ahead. Tempo. Have you one? Have the other arm. Keep those hips square. Proud chest. Look straight ahead. You're gorgeous. Watch that neck. Yeehaw. Inhale. Exhale. Make sure that knee is tracking with those toes. Yeah. Hold it back. Pull that elbow back. Kick. Remember, you want the elbow parallel to the floor. Belly in. Tail slightly tucked. Shoulders, don't creep them to your ears. Eight, seven, six. Pull that belly in deeper because I'm not upright. Three, two, and one. Weight down. Let's do the modified part. We don't have our hands on the floor. Okay? So we're going to reach down. Come up, lift that knee up, lunge back, come in, knee up, lunge, knee up. I reach the floor like I'm going to touch it, so you can stay just like this. You don't have to go into that full plank, right? Okay, I'm going to the full plank. My hand goes down, I tap the other foot back. I step in, I glide in. I lift that knee. Slide. Tap. In. Slide. In. Down. So it's hard to be on an eight count with this. We're all moving at our own tempo, right? We're moving. Down. Tap. Tap that knee. Slide it in. Lift that knee. I think you look amazing. Every minute you're with me today, you're making yourself stronger. Some of it may not be fun. You may be looking at your watch going, how much more time? <laughs> but you'll survive. You'll survive. Right, Jamie? Right. One more. Hold that knee up. Both arms. Lift. Point. Two, three, four, five, 
don't be too close to your mat. We're going to be doing a curtsy, squat, curtsy, squat, okay? All right, so arms just stay right here for now. Let's get the legs first. This leg goes behind. Curtsy, squat. Other leg, curtsy, squat. Curtsy, squat. Curtsy, squat. Got it? Curtsy, squat. Curtsy, squat. Curtsy, squat. Curtsy, You got it. Yeah. 
one. Okay. Wait down. Grab your drink. I'm gonna take my mat. Roll it in half. So I've got room for my legs. Just take it all the way down to the floor. Woo! Check it with that body. Take those sliders. Put your feet on top of them. Are we still smiling? <laughs> All right. Now, how the weights ready? You may not be able to use them for this. You may need the extra help with your hands. All right. So, zip that belly in and up. And we're going to take an alpha two, lift up two. Inhale, exhale. Now, if you really need a lot of help, your hands need to stay. If not, I'm grab my weights. Got it? Pull back. Push it out. Pull it back. Now make sure that neck isn't going like a turtle. Keep it nice your spine. I'm going to pick it up to tempo. Inhale. Exhale. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight more. Here we go. Eight. I'm a wide grip here. I go four more. Three. Number, hands behind those thighs if you need it. Okay, now press it out. Twist side. Press it out. Twist other side. Out. Twist. Out. Tempo. Out. Twist. Inhale, exhale. You can also, if you need more support, take your hands behind you. And the one hand twist, and the other hand will lift. Got it? Yep. Four, three, two, one. Press it out, and reach for the chest. We're going to bring it back. The lower back will touch. Come back up, bend your knees. Press it out. Lower back will touch. Lift up, bend your knees. Raise those weights. Hold it here. Shoulder press. So in and my hinge. Roll it back down. Press those legs out. Four, three, two, one. Up. Do it again. Bring it down. Melt those shoulders. Bring it up. Hold it here. Shoulder press. Got it. Three. Two. Take it back. Four. Three. Two. One. Other knees. Press it out. Bring it up. Shoulder press, go. Four, three, two, and one. Weight down, hands behind the thighs. Now we're gonna take it down. Stay with the legs straight, okay? One knee in, press it back out. Other knee, so my hands are here in case I need the support. I can also have my hands behind me again, wherever you get the most help is needed. If you don't need help, you're going to reach here. In. Tempo. In. So it's like I have my spine molded inside a tire, right? Now keeping that mold, keeping that rounded shape. You got it. Eight. Seven. Love these. Six. Five. Here's four, three, two, one, roll it all the way up, grab the ankles, and pull your torso forward. Good. Okay, let's flip over for some more planks. Remember, you modify wherever you need to. All right. So I'm going to go into a full plank. My knees are to the edge. I got my toes and my lighters. We're going to do a knee 
cross over. Shoulders over the wrist, tuck the tail, belly fold in, press it out. So I'm gonna draw my right knee in, thread it under, bring it back, and hold. Other foot. Come in, thread, in, and out. Got it? In, thread, in, out, in, thread, in, out, in, thread, in. One more each leg, you've got this. Woo, we're staying alive. And bring those knees in, release the feet, make cups with your hands. Woo. Okay, forearms on, you can also be a full plank. Press those pliers back out. We're gonna draw those knees in, press back out. So the booty's gonna lift a little bit and then iron that back out. In, in, out, out. In, in, out, out. In, out. And out. Three more. In, out. Two more, two more. One more. Woo! Bring those knees in and stretch back. Woo! Those were work, were they not? I'd say so. Okay, back over. Put your tail on the end. Grab that on your waist. You roll it back. Bring it up, up and over, jumping jack out, roll back down. Okay, let's try that again. So it's like a Pilates roll up. I roll up, my arms are parallel to my legs. I take out my belly, come back in, roll back down. Eyes and belly. Inhale. Exhale. Press out. Come in. Roll away. Four, three, two. Take it up. One, two, three, four. Out. In. Roll back. Three, two, one. Eyes to belly. Inhale. Exhale. Out. In. Roll back. Yep. And again. Up. Two. Three. Four. Out in twice. Pull it back. And then do a elbow to mat twice. Press back up. Bring it up. Four. Three. Two. One. Two jumping jacks. Pull it back. Elbows down to the twice. The chest press. Roll it up, eyes to belly, find it, find it. Jumping jack, belly is gonna be working here. Roll it back, four, three, two, presses. Can you give me just two more? Roll it back. Elbows bend and press. Woo! Take it up. Don't be dragging that head on that mat. Jumping jacks. Cool. Bring it back. Chest press twice. Now hold the weights up. Tabletop your legs. Make sure the back is nice and heavy. Turn the palms in. Reach out the right toes. Arms fly out. Bring it back up. Left toes. Elbows can't go with you. Neck is nice and long. I inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Oh, yeah. One more. Three. Shoot that belly. Two. 
Last one. Lift you down. Arms down. Release those weights. Arms to your side. Legs are one fist width apart. My knees and heels in a straight line. I want you to bridge up for me. Hold this bridge. Clasp those hands underneath. Reach those arms long. Nice and loose and hamstring. So walk them together. Reach the arms behind you. Keep it there. Inhale. Exhale. Lower that spine. Take your time. Take your time. Bring those arms around. Plug those knees in. Rock yourself up. Legs are straight. Slide yourself to the side. Give me a nice big inhale up. Spine goes tall, tall, tall. Exhale, reach out, grab where you can, and pull the torso towards the front. Now soften your right knee, soften it, and now just do a stretch with the left thigh. And then switch, the other knee lifts up. Both knees down, reach the arms parallel to the floor, pull that navel in. Zip it up. Four, three, two, and one. Relax your shoe to your side. You can stay straight legged or crisscross. Okay. Whatever feels better to your knees. So the arm closest to your screen keeps on your glider. Other arm comes up. Now the side bend. Now keep that opposite hip pushing down. Bring it back up. Other side, I'm sitting tall. I side stretch, push this hip down, bring it up, switch, inhale, exhale, switch, inhale, and exhale. Good. Look around. We're going to stretch the shoulders and the chest. Lie to behind you. And I want you to just reach back and get around my spine. And then lift them up like you're trying to squeeze your blades here. Tuck your tail. Get into your core. And just the And release. Good, shake it out. Okay, butterfly stretch. So I want the bottoms of your feet together. Grab onto your ankles, elbows against the knees, and let's push those knees as far as we can. The closer our heels are to our body, the more the stretches. And take your hands over the toes and use that as leverage to pull your torso a little closer. I want you to come onto your stomach, so this really isn't a flow stretch, is it? <laughs> We're going to come onto our stomachs. It's okay, our mats aren't all the way. I just want to make sure that my head isn't on my mat. And I'm going to make a pillow with my left hand. I'm going to bend my right knee. I'm going to reach back and pull it towards my glutes. At the same time I'm pulling it in, I want you to feel like you're pressing it away. If you want a little extra stretch, push off that left hand and you feel that, that um, quad is warm. And then release. Other side, make a pillow. Bend your left knee, grab it with your left hand. Go. Make sure you're breathing. And if you want, push off that bottom arm and push that foot further in that hand. Keep your hips on that back. And release. So we're going to try and do a push-up here, a plank. Okay, so my hands on my shoulders. I'll pull my belly in. I'm going to myself up off that mat. And I'm going to take it to a down dog. I'm going to walk my feet a couple steps towards that mat. I want you to really push the weights back and try to get those heels flat. Head hangs heavy. 
Now lift one heel and push the other heel deeper into that mat. Switch. And switch. No strain to the neck. Floor is pulling in and switch. Now two heels down. Walk your hands towards your feet and keep the hands on the floor. Try to stretch those hamstrings. Make your breathing. Now soften your knees, keep your hands there on the mat, and then slowly straighten out your spine, pull that belly in deeper. Inhale to bend those knees. Exhale, straighten as best you can. One more. Inhale. Now just the fingertips are back around my spine more. I pull that belly in deeper. Now give me another inch with that belly button pulling towards that spine and dangle the fingertips. You should not feel any pressure at that lower back. Now slowly start to bring yourself up from your core. Your tail is going heavy. Yep. The last thing that comes up is that neck. Face forward in a nice wide stance. Don't you take your right arm across the front of your body. A little pull. And bring that tricep behind. I want you to lunge away from that arm. I'm going to try and lift that opposite heel. And go and stretch my inner thigh. Come back up. Take the other arm through. Soften those knees. Good. Arm comes behind. Now lunge away from it. And feel like your booty is pressing back and your chest is coming forward. So you feel that stretch here. Good. And release. Give me a big inhale up. Exhale. And one more. 